this is Paul with PicoPros.com and today we're taking a look at the Android mini tablet from Nioncom using the HDMI out capability of the device. So here we're actually connected the Android mini tablet through the HDMI out port to an, uh, a 55 inch LCD screen. So you'd be able to see uh, the vast array of features uh, and applications you can view on a large viewing experience uh, such as an LCD screen in this case. So here we are. The first thing we're going to do is actually launch the browser. Here it's Yahoo, so you could surf the web, that kind of thing. And the first thing we're going to show you here is actually one of our favorite applications for the Android mini tablet, which is Image Ammo. So we're going to navigate to their website and show you how you can quickly and easily download what they call image file wrappers from the uh, Image Ammo website directly. So they house a number of image file wrappers on their site. In addition, you can create your own image file wrappers using your different photos and images and share those with anyone you wish. And you'll see this app in a second. It's really great stuff. So here's the Image Ammo website. We can zoom in, zoom out, that kind of thing. And in, the, in our case, we're going to navigate to the uh, player page. And here again, anything uh, that you're seeing on the LCD is basically coming from the Android mini tablet. Uh, so you can see it looks real nice. So we navigate to the player page and scroll down. And here you can see that Image Ammo houses a number of image file wrappers, including Pika Pros. Uh, but today we're actually going to look at, in our case, Geraci images. So Paul Geraci has some fantastic photography. Uh, in our case, we're going to look at some uh, island themed photography from Paul Geraci. So in, in that instant, you can see we click on it and immediately it starts downloading the image file wrapper. It only takes a few seconds to download. And here we go. It's already launching uh, into the image ammo application. So here they are. This photo set has a number of photos or images. And you can see that we're navigating from the Android mini tablet from Nioncom. And so we rotate the different shapes. In this case, it's a carousel type shape. And we could blow up the images, zoom in, zoom out, that kind of thing. Really high quality images here. Colors are fantastic, as you can see on the LCD screen. And uh, the contrast, of course, it, it, we're on an LCD screen, so it's just beautiful images. But uh, the feedback is instant. As soon as you hit the image on the LCD of the Android tablet, uh, you see the output on the LCD of the 55-inch uh, screen. Uh, we can navigate through different shapes here, whether it be a spiral, a carousel, uh, a wall of images, that kind of thing. Depending on what you're trying to present, whether it's a uh, PowerPoint presentation or photography or whatever it may be, uh, different shapes might be more advantageous uh, for that uh, presentation environment, if you will. So here you go. You can see, you know, uh, you can access a number of different image file wrappers and uh, you get the idea that it's really quick and easy to access and share those image file wrappers using the image ammo application that comes standard on the Android mini tablet from Nioncom. So again, here we are navigating on the LCD screen of the mini tablet and we're going to launch, in this case, Droid TV and the response through the HDMI port is instantaneous. Uh, in our case, we're going to launch a, an episode of Family Guy using the Droid TV app that also comes on the Android mini tablet. So you can see this is a 55 inch uh, display that we're using the HDMI out connected to. And immediately we launch this uh, uh, Family Guy episode. And you can zoom in, you know, get an idea, you can fast forward through the episode, uh, all kinds of things. So there's a number of different, obvi obviously, a number of different uh, television shows that you can access through Droid TV. Really, really nice app, especially for something that you can output that video to a large screen such as an LCD or project it via the embedded laser Pico projector, which will show in a different demonstration. So that's Droid TV in a nutshell. Um, so, so far we've shown you Image Ammo and Droid TV. Uh, the next thing we're going to show you is actually a game that comes uh, standard on the mini tablet from Nioncom. In this case, we're going to show you Asphalt. Uh, this is a racing game. 
So Asphalt's located in the top right hand corner. And so we'll launch that. So here's Asphalt, it's loading the program. This is a really neat racing game uh, that really takes advantage of the accelerometers that are embedded in the Android mini tablet. Uh, so this allows you to get a really immersive gaming experience. So real quick, we're going to select a car and a track, and it's going to load that for us. So you'll see in a second that the ability to interact uh, using the Android mini tablet with this racing game is really something special. So as opposed to using your iPod or iPhone, uh, it does have the accelerometers and you can steer with different racing games, etc. Uh, that gives you a very small display. With the video out capability or the embedded projector of the Android mini tablet, you can generate a really immersive large screen experience. And again, anything on the LCD of the device is mirrored by the HDMI out on the 55 inch LCD in this case. So here we are, we're gonna launch this race right here, and you'll see, immediately we start racing, we tilt the uh, device left or right, the car responds immediately, and it's a really, really enjoyable, immersive racing experience. Uh, it, it's a lot of fun, and uh, you, you really have to experience it in person to get a feeling for how amazing the experience is. I mean, it, you basically feel like you're in an arcade with the uh, steering wheel, that kind of thing. Uh, it, it's a truly amazing experience, especially when you consider you're getting this from a very small phone sized device. So check that out if you purchase the Android mini tablet from Niancom. The Vision tablet, uh, Memory Kick Vision tablet from Niancom will be available in the second half of 2011. So be sure to check that out. So the next thing we're going to show you here is an office document management uh, piece of software called ThinkFree. Basically, this software allows you to uh, manage all your Microsoft Excel, PowerPoint, and uh, Word documents. So here we're going to launch a quick expense report, which is basically an Excel file. So it's loading the Acme expense report. And here you go. Here's different expenses by date. Um, and you get an idea of uh, what kinds of things you'd be able to do. So you can zoom in and out using the multi-touch on the device, of course. Uh, that pretty much goes without saying. But you can see the embedded graphs, this kind of thing. So uh, whoever's presenting could be holding the mini tablet and presenting that data to a large group of people on a, either an LCD or with the embedded laser Pico projector. So it's a really nice device for office productivity. So here we're going to show you uh, a uh, Word document. In this case, they're calling it the Acme Quote. So it's basically a memo that somebody has written. So John Smith of Acme Corp, etc., cetera, etc., cetera. and uh, really nice stuff. So again, this is simply a Word document. You can zoom in, zoom out, present the information to whoever, share that information uh, via email or whatever uh, with different colleagues. So really, really neat stuff. You got office document management, you got gaming, you have uh, television shows, you have image management with the Image Ammo software, you have the full Android marketplace as you can see, you can download all your favorite apps. And so we'll leave it there. Again, this is Paul with PicoPros.com and we'll talk to you soon. Thanks.